I got a script from Roy Huggins at Universal. Roy was a producer at Universal. And one of the scripts that Universal sent me was a script called Rockford, called The Rockford Five, or maybe just Rockford. Anyway, it was a script that Roy had produced and Steve Cannell had written for ABC as a movie of the week. And ABC had never made it. I guess they didn't think much of it, but they never made it. I read it. And I said to Jim, oh, this is it. You really should do this. And Jim agreed. So we called Scheinberg and Roy, and they were very pleased and very thrilled. No, not Scheinberg. Frank Price was the head of television at Universal at that time, and I did not know Frank. So I called Scheinberg, and Scheinberg put me on to Frank. And I met, Jim and I both met with Roy and talked about doing this, the, the show, taking it away from ABC and putting it on the open market as a series to be bought with Garner. We had nobody else at that time. And Roy was going to be the supervising producer. I was going to be the executive producer. And Roy came here to the house to talk about it. And I said, I have to have Steve Cannell as a producer on the show or I won't do it. He didn't think Steve would be interested. But I said, well, you've got to get him or you don't have a show. So he convinced Steve, and I met with Steve and liked him, and we got along, and there was no doubt that he would do it. And um, so Frank decided to send it to NBC and said that here is a script, and Jim Garner will do it. You have 24 hours. And to nobody's surprise, they agreed. So then we were going to do the, the pilot, which Steve had written, the same script that I had read. Then it came to casting, and there was a little role of no importance with maybe one or two scenes about a guy that works for a newspaper in the down in the records department of the newspaper. But it was a funny scene. It was an interesting scene, just one scene. So Stuart Margold was shooting a movie in Arizona, and I called him up, and I said, listen, it's not important, but there's a scene in the pilot that we're going to do. You'd be great in it. It's just the one scene, but really, you'd, you'd love it. You'll be, you'll be great with, with Jim. It was a scene with Jim. So I sent him the script and he read it and he said, yeah, this was no, this was no recurring role. This was nobody who was going to be in the series. This was just the pilot. So then we cast the rest of the pilot with, not with Noah Beery, but with another man who played the father. Robert Donnelly? Yes. I think his name was, he was a New York actor. And the girl that played Davenport, the girl that played the, uh, the lawyer. And we made the pilot, and it was, it was a good pilot. Uh, Stewart was so fabulous in this little nothing scene that I said to Jim, he's got to be in the show. We got to keep him like we had him before in Nichols. We got to keep him, and so we did. We we uh, talked to Frank Price, who was perfectly willing to do it. We hired Stewart was willing. We hired Stewart, and we made the pilot. 